Hey, Craig here. Today I'm going to get you up and running with your new Cobalt 40 volt max chainsaw. So this is how I pulled it out of the box. So what I'm going to do is just unscrew this. Take this piece off. You're going to take your bar. Make sure the Cobalt is right side up. And see, you got the two holes here. That's how you know because um, you see these two little gaps. There's a, a little piece under here that's going to go into those. So once you got your chain the way it's going to go, then you go ahead and put put your uh, I mean the bar the way you want to go. You put the chain on. It just goes right in that little gap. And uh, this is the way when you're looking at it. I'll show you. This is the direction that the chain should be going. So the parts that slant kind of down that way are going into the, the, on the top, they should slant down as they're going into the saw. Check your manual if you have any questions on that. So you just slap that on there. This goes around the back wheel here. Then you're gonna just pop this back on. Let's see if I can do it. It's easier to lay it down, but I'm gonna try to do it upright just so you can see what's going on. You see there's a little uh, thing there that pops into the chain bar to kind of hold it. So you're gonna put that in. Like I said, on yours, lay it down on its back, much easier. Okay, then this is gonna pop on here. And you might have to adjust this. I had to turn it to the, ne the minus or the negative as it moves this little doodad here so I had to turn mine to the negative because this little thing sticking out has to go has to go in this hole here okay so you make sure that actually it's gonna go in the bottom hole okay once you've got it all down what I'm doing with my hand is I'm using some pressure to slide this forward a little bit and I'm gonna lay it on its back and we're gonna pop this in there's a peg sticking out here and here and you'll see the holes that those go into. And then once those are in, why do you just tighten it up? And then you want to check, make sure you have a little bit of looseness in the chain, but not too much. If it's tight on the bar, it's not going to spin well. So you use this minus and plus to tighten it or loosen it. And then that should be ready to go. We'll pop our battery in here. and fire it up. Well, that's disappointing. Oh, make sure you turn the safety off. I didn't realize this had a safety. So there you go. That pops, makes a little snap. There you go. And then before you operate it, make sure you put in your chain oil. You don't put in chain oil, you're gonna ruin this thing. So open this guy up and fill this little reservoir with your uh, chainsaw oil. All right, hope this helped. Have fun sawing out there, be safe. Always wear protective gear. Thanks for watching, have a blessed day.